You know, noob noob, what no one saw coming? Black Wesker. I mean, maybe they saw that coming, but what they really didn't see coming was the cancellation after one season of Resident Evil. Netflix. Whatever this thing was called. That's right, Noob Noob. I know you're very sad. Super sad. Super sad. Super serial. I oh. think I pieced out after two episodes. I know she, like, the lead girl jumped into, like, a crowd of zombies or something. Or, like, uh, jumped off of a building. That was a thing. There was, like, a zombie crocodile. That no, I never got that far. Yeah. No, you'll have to explain. You'll have to spoil everything for us because no one will remember in three months that there was a Netflix Resident Evil. This had so much hype too. Everyone was super excited about. It. Well, oh, okay. Netflix was super. <laughs> Netflix was super excited. Netflix about Netflix was super excited about it. I don't know if yeah. anybody else was. Well, we can go to the article and take a look. Resident Evil series canceled. Canceled after yeah. one season. It was a thing. Very sad. I mean, this is this is very sad. I it's, honestly thought it was going to get at least another season because Netflix dumped. Some they money into they it. were like, "We're doubling down on this." To be fair, they fucking renewed Umbrella Academy. Did wait for season four? Yup. No, they did Absolutely. it. Absolutely. Oh my god. It was announced today. Oh well, we could have done a video on that. You didn't tell me that. I don't need a video on that. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I couldn't even get through season three of that yeah. either. It's getting hard to watch TV, folks. It's getting hard. And it's hard to invest in anything. Like, if you genuinely like this, which, if it wasn't named Resident Evil, maybe you could have, because if it had been a different property, it might have been interesting. Right? Like, let's just say it was a post-apocalyptic zombie thing, but not named Resident Evil. Do you think it would have been okay? Uh, probably not. Still. I mean, it it was. That's the uh, people wouldn't have hated it as much. Yeah, people wouldn't have hated it as much. That's for sure. They're saying uh, that the show debuted at number two with seventy two million viewing hours. That doesn't sound like a lot when when they're talking about like Terminalist that had like six billion or something. Did it, what? It had a lot. Terminalist had a lot of billions of hours. At Did least the boys have more. Uh, I don't know about that. Sure, uh, it's, boys it's crazy. Best. It only debuted at number two. Yeah, it's kind of messed up. Uh, but it did not deliver a big week two bump, which they were hoping to see by word of mouth. And it dropped to number three before falling out of the top ten after three weeks. Oof. Oof. And uh, the it only logged an underwhelming 55% from critics and 27% from audience scores on Rotten Tomatoes. And Netflix assembled a compelling, <laughs> diverse oh my God. cast for Resident Evil and their goal to work with them in the future. Uh, apparently, the streamer's already going forward with one of the actors. Paola Nunez in the yeah f yeah oh that's only gonna be a Netflix f film from Latin America sure wait there's whatever a Netflix Resident Evil no fall she's gonna be is she I think it's a she uh, Fall of the House of Usher and In Fuega del Rienes no thanks well you know Resident Evil's not continuing they still have other hits we promise you they do like Stranger Things Arcane The Witcher Umbrella Academy. <laughs> Shadow and Bone, Vikings, that's a thing. Sweet Tooth, that was a hit. Black Mirror, the newest arrival, Sandman. Sandman ain't getting a season two. Sorry, folks. Hate to tell you that, which has been a breakout. What? Get out of here. It's not even been number one. It has been number two and beaten by, by a really pathetic show, which I cannot remember what it is. The show is, I like I said, I pieced out. I watched the first episode and was like, yeah, I'm out of this. I'm not that invested in Resident Evil to continue wasting my time on this. I mean, I, I, I would have watched another season, I guess. You watched it. It got better. D that is what I heard. I feel like it, it started off real weak. And it, I mean, I would have liked to see a CGI alligator thing. It was real bad. 
<laughs> I just want to read some of these comments. I really like this show. The flashbacks in the past were really good. I binged it in a night. Oh my gosh. So sad. <laughs> I don't know about really liking it, but it was, it got to the point where I was like, it's okay. Uh, love this show. Shame that the fanboys panned it before it got a real chance. Okay. Uh, really wanted to like this show. I had high expectations. It was a mess and not good. <laughs> Dang, now I'll never know if she's able to get her kid back or how her life shaped with her with their uncle who looks exactly like their father. What? I don't even, what? There's an uncle and a father? Yeah, I don't I don't understand why this franchise is so hard to adapt. It's literally people get trapped in a haunted house. Get out of haunted house. How is that hard? Yes, this is not anything This is not like rocket that. science, folks. Nothing like that at all. I mean, that's literally what the first game is, and even the second game on some level, right? Uh, yeah, I think so. Yeah. Uh, boy, keep canceling good stuff and see how many subscribers leave Netflix. Getting sick of tired of watching stuff, and then, and then long before it gets canceled. I, I mean, that's the part that I get is regardless of whether or not you liked it. Netflix loves to do this where they just kill stuff before it even gets any legs. Like a lot of TV series don't end up blowing up or getting good until like later seasons. So like you said, you felt it got better in the end. What made you think that it got better in the end? Uh, more Black Wesker. I mean, I do like Lance, Lance Reddick. Reddick. He is he awesome. He was the best part. Yeah, he had some... Uh, from what I saw of him, he had some pretty cool scenes. He, yeah. I mean, when he dressed up as Wesker, that didn't look very good. It was kind of insane. Like, that was just... <laughs> he's, like, he's like, I'm going to be Blade, but not Blade, but not yeah. Wesker. He what was, about the dance party at the end? There was, was a whole... Bottom below, or he was a uh, bottom dollar, or a five, what, Dollar Tree version of... Uh, Blade? Wesker, Blade, yeah, yeah. Really? Why is he Dollar Tree version? Because he looked cheap as shit. Oh, oh, you mean like his costume? And yeah, everything. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was gonna say the actor is not Dollar Tree. No, 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 he's great. No, no. Okay. Yeah, yeah. The flashback scenes were the best part, so I don't know how they would have incorporated more of that in the second season. <laughs> Considering they two the two caught up, right? Nah, Didn't they no, catch up? Not really. No. So they, they could have shown more they flashbacks. They could have shown more. They could have found a way. But With it, more it Billy, gotten, Billie Eilish scenes. Yeah, would have gotten harder. And like the the adult kids were not great. Didn't like the main girl. She's the girl from uh, Charlie's Angels. She is. She's not a great she actress. Not great. She's not great. The the girl from who the the hot Mexican girl was kind of cool. I like her. The CEO who did the dance party? Yeah, yeah, the dance party. Wh she which, kinda, explain that to attractive. me. What, what happened there? There's a part where she literally just starts TikToking. The Asian sister took control of her with an iPad. Mind and body. And made her dance. And that, what was the point of that? Because she was leading Umbrella Corp, but they needed to, she needed to puppet her so everyone thought she was leading Umbrella Corp. The for, CEO. For what purpose? Why? I, I, dude, I don't know. They just Why? did things. Did they? Yeah. Confused. It was very... Uh, uh, yeah, it wasn't great. I forget how it ended. Like, it it ended on a cliffhanger. Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, got it. You can spoil it because there's no second season. I think I remember now. So Spoiler. there was a giant alligator. Large that, that, alligator. That was um, their trump card. So Umbrella Their trump Academy, card was they made a alligator. Umbrella Academy found the refugee camp and whatever. And, and Naomi Wasn't it Harris, on a boat? It was on a boat. So that's and, why they need an alligator. And whatever... Who wrote this? I don't know who Naomi Harris is or whatever the... Whatever the black lead actress is. They're dragging across underneath a zombie alligator. So then when She's she She's dragging dire, across? What do you mean? They cut the anchor. Like, it's tethered to the ship. The the, ga the gator The is. gator's okay. tethered, locked up underneath the water. Okay. So they cut it loose. And then it goes bananas. Starts eating everybody. Starts doing a whole bunch of shit. Uh, then the, the bad Asian sister, you know, I, I think the CEO that's hot dies. I think I'm not sure <laughs> you were paying um, close attention to this, but Asian sister shoots black sister. It's very sad. Uh, alligator dies. Okay. And Asian they can sister always make another. steals black sister's kid. And that's how it ends. I think. Oh, Wesker is apparently dead in the future timeline, so that's why he's I'm been. Not well, he was. Or no, this is this takes place after all of the games. So it he's does. already been dead. 
That was, now, that was my understanding. keep in mind, there's like 17 versions of Wesker. So original OG Wesker, they do reference the game. He's been they, dead. Yeah, they say like, oh, he died in a volcano by getting crushed by a boulder. That's what happened in Resident Evil 6. Gotcha. So that's cool. I like the references to the games. This is beyond the games. But the games didn't have like 37 Weskers. <laughs> they only had so one Wesker. more opportunity for Lance Reddick to shine. I'll, I'll take that. There was a lot of Alice's though. But she's not part of the games. Alice was not in any of this. Oh, okay. Yeah, no Alice's. No mention of Alice. No Mila Jovovich. No. Uh, just some very... Oh, Ada Wong was a reference, I think. They were like, hey, they look, it's Ada, Ada Wong. Wong. She's yeah. my mom. Um, Ada it, Wong it was is my kind mom. Of a, the, the future timeline was wonky. I, I can imagine. So, so I guess on a level of one to sad, I mean, I'm not shocked from the reception that it got. Again, if I could have gotten past like two episodes, maybe I would have kept one. I just, I couldn't. I couldn't. I don't know. It just was not compelling TV. I tried real hard. Uh, it's like a six. Like a, like a, a five. six out of like ten. A five or a six. Okay. Maybe. I think it was 5.6 on IMDb. Wasn't great. It yeah. wasn't horrible, but it wasn't great. It wasn't like... Yeah, because like it's not like an un. We've watched some pretty unwatchable things. So it wasn't yeah. unwatchable, right? Uh, no, no, no. Like you could get through it, and it got better as it went. So am I sad it got canceled? No, but would I have watched the season two? Yeah. Yo, you're all in. I would have watched it. <laughs> all in. I would have watched it for sure. All in. Well, that's the news. Netflix strikes again, chopping out stuff and making people sad. So. If you like what you heard today, we would love it if you gave us good old sub and uh, subscribe, like, do all those things, share this with other people, let them know about the tragedy of Resident Evil being canceled. Because if you don't like it, subscribe. Noob Noob might do this. I will turn myself into a horny alligator <laughs> and unleash myself on you and your family. I will start with your parents first. Work my way to your dogs and cats. Nibble, nibble, nibble. Leave your siblings just nibble. so they can watch the carnage that happens to you. Num, num, nums. Unless you like and subscribe. Well, and we can all be one big happy family. Well, make that happen, folks. Uh, but as for us, we are on to the next one.